I'm going to show you how to mount Windows Server 2012 R2 into Hyper-V on a Windows 2008 server. So we are in our server here. We're going to go ahead and create a new virtual machine. Click Next. And we're going to call it Windows 2012 R2. Next. And we'll give it memory. I'll just go ahead and give it 1024, so 1 gig of RAM. Run a little slow, but not too much. Let's choose our local area connection virtual network so it can get out on the internet if we want it to. And then here's our location. We're going to go ahead and put it into the default location. And we're going to give it a size of defaults to 127 gigabytes. We're just going to go ahead and give it 50 gigabytes. We don't need that much. And we're going to install the operating system from CD DVD. And then we click the image ISO file. I've already downloaded the ISO file from MSDN. Here it is right here. Next, and finish. All right, so now I can go ahead and start, and it should boot off my ISO file just as if it was a DVD. And there it is. And we should get a screen that says Windows 2012 installation at this point. And here it comes. All right, the next video will be installing the Windows Server 2012 R2.